now that Goron Link has been given permission to carry powder kegs, we can go to the bomb shop right over here and purchase a powder keg for 50 rupees. I certainly can, Mr. Goron. Now you might be wondering, hey, what are you going to do with this super huge bomb? I'm actually going to use it to help fight evil aliens from outer space. Yes, that's right. Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask has alien fighting. I guess we really should have seen this coming, what with the giant moon about to crash into the earth and everything. So head on down to the ranch and use the powder keg to open up the way to Romani Ranch. Yep, setting off the huge bomb here gives us access to the ranch on day number one. We already saw what happens on day number three if you don't stop the aliens. Horrible things happen, so that's why we have to go there on day one and stop the aliens before they attack. Okay, this guy seems perfectly fine with the fact that we basically took him out of the job. And here we are in the ranch, and you'll notice that this time there are all sorts of cows, right? Here are the cows. We have all sorts of animals living here on the ranch. Very happy cows. And what happened to the people who are living on the ranch? I think here she is. Here we go. Here's Premia. Remember her? She's the owner of the ranch. Let's talk to her. Yep, I came from town, all right. Oh, good. And talking to her lets her know that she can leave the ranch to deliver some milk. She will be doing that, uh, I think, in the next day of the game. We'll get to that later, but for now, when you run up to the ranch house, you will meet Romani, the little girl who lives on the ranch. Oh, and here's this scene about Link's horse again. Yep, that's Epona. But now that Miss Romani is doing perfectly fine and has not been abducted by aliens, she's able to talk to us about our horse. Oh, don't run away, Romani! I want to talk to you. My name is Link. Oh! Romani gives us the name Grasshopper. Romani talks in the third person. That is what Romani does. And tonight, the aliens are coming. Aliens. ALIENS! And here are the aliens now. The evil cow abducting aliens. Oh, this isn't good. These are creepy looking aliens. So, what Romani is doing right now is trying to save the ranch from the aliens. Sorry to hear that. I believe you, Romani. Grasshopper believes you. He's going to help you stop those aliens. We're going to be fighting aliens in this game. This is so cool. It's really, really weird and out of place, but it's also really, really cool. This is why I love Majora's Mask. Other people don't like Majora's Mask, they don't think it's as good as Ocarina of Time, and it's not. It's a completely different sort of game. Ocarina of Time was mostly about going to dungeons and finding all seven sages, whereas this game is mostly just not so much going to dungeons, because there are only four dungeons, it's more meeting people, hanging out with them, figuring out what problems they're having, and helping solve their problems. 
It's a different sort of gameplay mechanic, and I just really like it. I like running around helping other people. That's more fun than going to dungeon after dungeon after dungeon. At least that's what I think. I guess I just like plot and character development more than dungeon crawling. Anyway, back to my live commentary, which was already in progress before I started this digression on Majora's Mask versus Ocarina of Time. Okay, good, 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 finally caught that one. Let me see, there were ten in all, right? And the record is a minute, so wow, I managed to get pretty close to the record, except I don't know where the last one is, so... I won't be able to beat the record, because I don't see the last balloon. Okay, where's that last balloon? Wow, I don't see it anywhere. Do you guys? Maybe it's behind the bar. There it is. Yeah, it's behind the bar. Okay, so that's a pretty good score. Oh, great! Now she's going to teach us the song to call our horse. This is Epona's song! I remember this! So now Link and Romani are good friends. Which is nice, Link doesn't have enough friends in this game. I mean, the only other friend he has so far is Mr. Monkey. Sure, the Gorons like him, but they didn't like Link, they liked Darmani. So, yeah, Link doesn't have any friends besides Romani and Mr. Monkey. Link needs more friends. What happened to Saria? She was Link's friend, but she's not in this game. So, looks like Link's gonna have to be friends with Romani. The only other character in the game who's pretty much the same age as he is. Except for Kaifei, who we'll meet later on. And he doesn't count. For reasons which will be apparent when we meet him later on. Before I finish this video, and start up the next video of awesome alien fighting action, here's a little clip of what happens when you go to the ranch at nighttime and you go inside Romani's house, you can talk with Romani and Premia.